and lay them out on a flat surface on the ground on the table it really doesn't matter get them as flat as possible you don't want any of this on the bottom so now that you have them flat you want to get a depending on what you want or how short or how long you want your shorts I would get a pair of shorts that I already have and measure it that way. These are a pair of shorts from American Eagle. Probably my most favorite shorts of them all. And basically what you do is you get these shorts and you put them up to the pants that you're about to cut and just basically just measure it out. Make sure this up here is flush or and from here you want to kind of pat it down to make sure everything is flat the biggest mistake that people make is when they get pants and they're trying to cut them they cut them straight across you don't cut your pants straight across you want to cut them at an angle if you notice these pants are at, if you pull them all the way out they're at an angle now if you want this if you want your pants to do this, to have that cuff, make sure you go lower than what you, so if you want your shorts at the top of your knees, make sure you go a little bit below your knees. You just hold the pants like this and cut across. Or, yeah. Now, remove these pants, and there you have them, shorts. Now, a few things you can do to spice up your shorts and make them, or bring character to them, is you can get these little threads in here and pull them out. I guess to make them like this, this is what I mean. You see how it's like frayed at the end? And I just take a thumbtack or any type of sharp object and dig into like the very, the very edge of it. 